how do you do a split screen effect like seeing two video clips on one screen first you want to select the two video clips that you want to appear on the screen at the same time you will have to go to add media click on it go to files and folders I want to select jellyfish press the control button select sea aquarium click open so immediately my project assets panel will open up and you will see the two clips the pink jellyfish and the sea aquarium sign so let's do it one by one let's bring down the sea aquarium signboard first click on it drag and drop onto the track video 1 track be careful not to put into video 2 track all right drop it the name of the tracks can be seen here video 1 video 2 let's watch it close the project assets panel playback so now I want to do a split screen I want to see this video clip together with my pink jellyfish video clip so what to do next go to my project assets panel pick up the pink jellyfish drag and drop onto this time video 2 track if you notice the pink jellyfish clip is longer than the aquarium sign clip let me zoom out a little bit I'm going to trim the jellyfish clip to be the same duration as the uh, signboard clip okay, close the project assets panel bring my cursor to the beginning of these two clips and playback If you notice the jellyfish clip is playing and now you cannot see the aquarium sign clip it's because the jellyfish clip is sitting on the top layer video 2 track whatever is on top covers whatever is on the bottom to make it clear let me open up this track here so that you can see the thumbnails and you know what we are dealing with to make it clearer I want to zoom in to reveal the bottom clip so that I can see two clips at one time I will have to make the top clip smaller select this clip by clicking on it go to the applied effects in the applied effects panel go to motion click on motion immediately you see a, a white rectangle with square handles around it adjust the square handles inwards your image gets smaller you notice now we are beginning to see the aquarium sign behind okay you can go very small but let's say I just want about this size then let's drag it to the right and place it here I want to do the same thing to the sign click on the sign board clip here and then go to apply effects click on motion again you see the white rectangle and adjust the square handle same make it smaller push it to the left so now you can adjust from the screen itself no need to press the clips anymore so let's enlarge this guy and then enlarge this guy do a little bit more adjustment signboard move a little bit here jellyfish move a little bit here enlarge a little bit more make it the same size go down and there I have two video clips on one screen how do I know let's go back to the beginning of these two clips by clicking on this I bring my playhead back to the beginning of these two clips let's play 
There you go, two clips playing on one screen. You may ask, how? what if I want to see a bigger version of each clip instead of a reduced size? That is, the jellyfish filling up almost half the screen and the signboard filling up almost the other half of the screen and get to see less blacks behind. So here goes, what we need is the crop effect. I go to effects, search for crop effect. Crop, there you go, crop. Drag and drop the crop effect into the signboard clip. You can see by default it crops for you this way. That's not what I want. Going into the applied effects panel, click on crop. So let's do the cropping. I just want the words. Okay, make it taller. Taller. That's it. Now, I want to make it bigger. I have to go back to the motion effect. Let's expand this wider, make the height the same as the screen and push it to the left this much. That's a little bit more. Okay. Now let's crop the jellyfish. Okay, go to effects. My crop is still selected here. Drag and drop the crop effect into the jellyfish clip. Go into the apply effects panel, click on crop. Let's crop just enough to see the jellyfish. Increase the height. Increase the height. Yep. Now making it larger, I click on motion and expand the adjustment rectangle. Let me expand the height to it's just nice first. Then I push it to the right to cover up the empty space. Right, the two images are covering the whole screen now. Let's bring my playhead back to the beginning of these two clips and watch. There, two video clips on one screen, or what you like to call the split screen effect.